Welcome to Cook, Serve, Delicious 2 and my continuing attempts to do all the Chef for Hire events at all the restaurants and get a medal each time, preferably gold or silver. Last time around I think I did a shift at Eaties and I said there was one left at the three restaurants I was concentrating on which are Eaties, Chinese food, beverage and sauces and breakfast and break loose. There's one left at breakfast and break loose which is the last shift and if I was in the right mood I would do that one next. However, it's been a long hard day at work and other things so I just need to relax. So I'm going to move on to Gri Itali, casual dining. And the first shift there, which has lasagna, chicken and don't know what that food is. With looks like mixed vegetables, salads and beans. And beer is the drink, 25% bars and six serving stations. But as is the norm when I start the first restaurant at, or the first shift at any restaurant, the information. Gri Itali is the oldest restaurant currently still in operation. In 146 BC, after Rome defeated Greece in the Battle of Corinth, Greece's economy was devastated. While the situation was grave for many Greeks, one silver lining was the opening of the restaurant Simul, later becoming known as Gri Itali, which combined the best of both Greek and Italian cuisine. Over the years, many politicians appointed to Gri Itali as justification for invading foreign nations, with some politicians suggesting that the First World War itself was an unsuccessful attempt to combine dozens of different cuisines into one. Since the opening of Gri Itali, many famous celebrities have been seen dining at the restaurant, including Augustus, Ac Augustus Caesar, Benito Mussolini, and Jake from the Pizza That commercials. Okay, that's a different combination of celebrities. So, onwards and upwards with the first shift at Gri Itali. I'll probably do a few of these in a row, because, well, just because, basically. I'm like that, I do things just because. As is the norm, I'd like to get a perfect day so I get a very pretty gold medal. And I should really at this level. Because it should be relatively slow. As long as I can remember how to do lasagna. Okay, and the only other thing I can prepare are sides. So that's all the sides prepared. Okay, I don't know what this third dish is yet that I've got. Well, there's quite a few steamed vegetables and green beans. And sides. Okay, and I've got 73 seconds before customers become impatient for their orders. Which is nice. The wall is a different pattern, I must admit, and the customers look a little more upper class than I'm used to. Just a little more. I mean, the guy with the big chain over on the left there is hardly upper class. And I still haven't had any of this, whatever this third dish is that I don't know the name of. I've got a rush hour coming up. My side salads have just expired. So I might as well create some more of them. Well, I'm prepared for the rush hour I'm going to be, considering I don't know one of these foods and I haven't seen it yet. Okay, I've seen it now. What is it? Okay, it's apparently eggplant, eggplant parmesan. Uh, number five would be good. Number two's cooked. Okay, this eggplant food cooked pretty slowly by the looks of it. Okay, I want eggplant, tomato sauce, parsley and parmesan. Okay, is this going to be the same 
stuff each time. Um, number two's cooked, number three would be good to start, number one's cooked. Yes, it looks that way. Uh, five. Appears to be the rush hour over with. And all my sides seem to have expired. Ah, uh, four and number three. Yeah, now I need some lasagna. P.S. What the heck is spinach? One, number five is done, number two's done. Okay, now perhaps I can prepare some more sides. I haven't had up to this point is a dishwasher full of dishes to wash. Strange enough, that's what dishwashers do. Oh, I've got a hippie waiting for food with a bandana and a yellow vest. And I've got a rush hour coming up. Okay, now I've got the hang of the eggplant. The food. That's not an, aimed as an insult to anybody, just in case you were wondering. It's an easy food to do, now I know what it actually requires of me. Two, three, number four. Number five. Oh, and I've run out of lasagna again, and my side salad has just disappeared. Gold okay, number four is done. Number one is the dishes. Five is done. Season that. Breading on top of that. Oil and eggplant. And number four is a beer. Oh, and number five can be cooked. And number three can be served and a nice chore. Well, I really don't need any more side salad, but because I can, I'm going to. Yeah, my sides are about to expire again, but it's late enough in the day, I'm really not too worried about that. There goes the mixed veg. Oh, somebody wants some chicken. There goes the green beans. Oh, somebody else wants some chicken. I'm not sure I'm with this serving chicken ten minutes before the end, end of the day. They're keeping my serving staff and my cleaning staff waiting. That was a nice sedate day for the first shift at Griotali, and a perfect day it was too, with a nice pretty gold medal, and I've managed to unlock floor number seven, some kind of carpeted floor. Not a very pretty one, but you can't have everything in life. So that was the first shift at Griotali. How many are there? Well, there's 12 in total. And it's going to get busy. And there's loads of foods I haven't seen up to this point. Next time around, it's going to be lasagna quiche, I think that is. And spaghetti and meatballs. Quiche, I think, if vaguely remember, is quite a lot of key presses to prepare. I don't remember spaghetti and meatballs at all. But, 
Alright, hang on, let me get back. Oh, all shifts are unlocked as well, all 12. Didn't notice that when I first went in there. So that gives me plenty of scope to do stuff. Okay, and as is my norm at this point, let's go read the email. The easy way to build muscle strength and get fit. Oh yeah, there's an easy way. Don't bother with weights, cardio or dieting. Just lift stuff. Bringing groceries into the house? Do a few curls with those grocery bags. Walking down the street with a friend? Carry your friend on your back. Sitting at a desk all day? Start lifting your chair and work your way up to lifting your whole desk. There's always something to lift. Send me a self-addressed envelope and $30 and I'll send you my award-winning list of other things you can lift. Abs Tony. Extension 4644. Yeah, I don't think I'll send you a self-addressed envelope and $30, Tony. But thank you for the wonderful advice. Okay, so that was the first shift at Griatali Casual Dining. As always, I hope you enjoyed... And hopefully I'll see you down the road for more Chef for Hire events in Cook Serve Delicious 2. Cheerio!